Okay, well here I am with just a few grocery items. So, ended up going the wrong way um, um, in Nara, checking out like the other side of town. But sort of the benefit is I found a new place, a big, big mall with a big uh, supermarket in the basement with really good prices. Um, I think these oranges, I think this was altogether, I think it was 400 yen which would mean each of these is less than a hundred because there's five of them so that's a pretty good deal I guess that would be 80 yen per I can't do math anyway good price on oranges I think it's because they're going to expire soon possibly but interestingly they're actually they're from Australia so they must not be in season in California yet but um, I have seen California ones but you can get you can get decently priced fruit. I'm really surprised because everyone always says, "Oh, you know, it ter it's terribly expensive." But this is not this is not too bad. It comes out to maybe like a dollar a piece or so, which it's not it's not a big deal. Maybe about the same price for apples. So let me move the the fruit aside for now because it's distracting. But what I was really interested in is, is getting some good bread. So I noticed they had a whole lot of white bread. Unfortunately, you know, it's very white bread society. Um, they like toast and things like that. You can get that in coffee shops really easily. But what you'll get is a piece of white bread with the butter already on it, which is okay. But, you know, I kind of like... I kind of like good bread, so I really like uh, you know wheat bread. So this is the closest I could find. And I'm going to compare two two varieties. This one that has sort of uh, some uh, some wheat chunks still stuck in it, so it's a little authentic. Although, unfortunately, I think it's mostly a sort of white bread fluff around it. But uh, that's okay. It's close. <laughs> this other one is is. Um, this one is I'm more optimistic about it. Um, it just it just looks better, and I think it was a little costlier. But uh, okay, we'll 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 try it out. I'll try out this one first. I'm just gonna take a bite. Mm. I'm get another bite. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, it's okay. I don't know. I would kind of rather just get fresh bread from a bakery around here. But, um, yeah. And this would work, I guess. Uh, it's okay. This one, which I'm more optimistic about. Let's try this. Now that looks good, just on the top. Mmm. Ah! Falling down. Mmm. This one is more what I was expecting. This is pretty good. This is decent. Yeah, this is good quality, but you pay a little more for it, I guess. But I think it's worth it. There's some instructions for how to cook up some things with it. Oh. Yeah. I don't know. I think I'm just going to stick to eating it plain. <laughs> um, well, there was our bread experiment. I, I vote for the one on the right. That one was good. Let me see if I can get the brand here. If I could find them. Right here. Mm. Can't, read. Can't read the kanji. <laughs> and I'm really so... I'm really so with the uh it's the katakana Buru. oh it's just as bread though <laughs> rye something oh rye bread oh okay rye bread I think <laughs> okay that's the one that I like and this other kind what is this this is also rye it's the same variety it looks like rye I think so yeah it must be. And this must just mean bread. No? This is a different kanji over here. No, that's the same. It's just stylized. 
Very interesting. So they've had bread for quite a while. Um, as you can see, they have their own kanji for it. <laughs> had it for hundreds of years, I think probably 500 years or so, because they traded with the Portuguese and imported it, and I guess they have their own kanji for bread. But there it is. Yep, okay. This video has gone on too long. <laughs> Alright, so long.